Day nonton konser Ayu. You know, I've just realized like how centered my eyes will be whenever I'm too focused on one thing. Like, look at that. It's so scary. I just tried to straighten out my hair a little since I want for my buns to be neat and clean because yeah I'm gonna put my hair up in a double bun puka bun hi everyone hari ini ada di day nonton konser ayu tadi pagi aku masih belajar beberapa kali minggu depan aku masih ada midterm tapi sekarang aku udah mau siap-siap talk sekarang jam setengah 12 lebih terus aku lagi panasin makanan dari family mart Habis makan aku bakal langsung make up -an, rambut, ganti baju Terus kita berangkat jam setengah 4, karena aku janjian jam 4 Di Taipei Arena hmm, So excited, tapi kayak rada tegang juga jujur Terus aku dari tadi pagi kayak coba untuk hafalin fan chant dari guide di Youtube gitu <laughs> Karena ada banyak banget loh ya, aku kira kayak cuma ada dikit Jadi aku gak expect buat harus hafalin begitu banyak, tapi ternyata baik banget Semua aku hafal ya It's too hot. After lunch, I started with my makeup. I just did my base just like I, how I used to do it. But I did wear some foundation. And I think because I did a really good skin prep beforehand, my makeup lasts all day long. And it looks very good even up until night. And I'm very proud of it. And the eye makeup is also looking good. So this is the final look. And I just moved on into my hair. But I didn't record that much because my camera actually died um, in the middle. But here's the final look of the makeup. Hello everyone, it's currently 3.20 and I'm already going to go to the concert. Yeah, I'm actually very like shy right now because I feel like I'm going to stand out a lot. So I decided to take the MRT because there are two options whether I'm going to go by a bus or by an MRT but I think it's going to rain so I'm gonna take the MRT I don't know what's the relevance but yeah so super super excited but I feel like it's going to rain so I'm a little bit worried about that but it's fine see you There's so many cute sellers that sells goodies, unofficial goodies. As you can see there, it's like the line for the merchandise pretty long. 
turn out that long line is because someone is giving freebies. So cute. I want to go, but the line goes up until like there. So it's crazy. There are so many IU New Balance ads, and I heard it's because they are one of Taipei Arena sponsors. See? Yeah, bagus. Lilac, lilac. But warna cushion-nya tuh kayak kayak teletubby, sejur. Oh, ini buat YouTube? Ha ha. Tuh kan, masalahnya bentuknya hati, jadi gemes banget. Eh. Tuh kan, kak beli figurin. Gantikan kunci, gantikan kunci. Ini apa? Stiker? Iya, stiker. Logonya bagus sih, stiker logonya. Ih, itu gak sih beli slogan tuh? Itu tuh tuh yang di bawah. Tuh kanan, kanan bawah. Oh. Kayak gitu.我最近走过最高的最远处的那个地方，那么那么高，大家会觉得害怕，不舒服，我自己是感觉有一点害怕的，괜찮으세요，지금大家还好吗？ 
my butt is hurting the whole time, but it's still a very good experience and she's so pretty and her singing is definitely like you don't need to question her about it. And I look at her and we also did a surprise thing. And yeah, it's so fun. Thank you for the photo. Wow, wow. <laughs> Me, the slogan. I think it's supposed to mean that she hasn't been here for five years. I'm currently at the gym, if you can tell, and <laughs> I'm going to show you the like the merchandise thing, the goodies that Ayu's mom gave to us during the concert while talking to you about my experience. So as you can see here, it's not for sale. Just to keep that, you know, it's not for sale, so. It's kind of limited edition or whatever. <laughs> What's really amazing is that it's very easy. Like the process is smoother than I expected because it was my first time for a concert and I've been very like nervous about it. I'm just scared that I will not go through security properly or whatever, but it went pretty fast. I faced some problems because like the worker couldn't couldn't read my English name because it's too long. So they had to kind of call the manager and then she confirmed the passport number to me. But other than that, it's fine. It's very chill. Like the line was long, but it took me like probably 10 minutes to get in. Inside the stadium, it's not crowded at all, even though there are many people. There's no long lines for the toilets which is surprising and the toilet is clean and inside the aircon is good and I do have a hard time because I had long nails I had big nails insert picture please and I couldn't like I couldn't put on my pants put on my skirt properly so I had to take my thumb nail like off but other than that, I had a very amazing experience and even though I was miles away, like I can still see her like shining. And here is like a photo card freebie that I got from a fan. It's very cute. It's, like there are lots of fans like giving goodies and freebies, but I didn't get to lots of them because the line was pretty long and I got too lazy. Ah, this is like a photo card and a photo card holder very cute she's very pretty and oh there there are two of them wow there are two of them what's a pity is that they didn't let us record so i had to record in secret like i got my ass busted for a couple of times but it's still fine i got i got professional at it Here's the keychain. It's very cute. I feel like overall her voice is very memorable. Like I, I know she can sing very well, but I didn't think that it is that well. Like her live vocals, I think is even better than the recording that we hear in her song. I love the dancers. Like I think they add up so much like dimension and interesting factors towards the performance because i think like it's pretty hard for a solo artist to fill out the stage by herself and by having those dancers um the lighting the band and ayu herself it's just a perfect combination of a stage and because i sat back at the tribute and i'm also high up like i'm very high up I can kind of see like the whole stage. Also, my most favorite part is the whole, I don't know how to pronounce this, but Horsey. yeah, that stage, like there, she did it two times, right? During the intro and outro. And during the outro, there are little children. I feel very cute. Like they dance together and had fun. Ah. Also celebrity got like a whole storyline as well. It's very nice. and. That's what I like. Like you can kind of differentiate which section she's in. What's even more amazing is that after the concert ended, like the whole stadium was literally empty. Like there's no lineup before toilets, escalator, and even for MRT, 
it's like it's not it's even empty i remember that we we got kind of shocked because it is that empty and yeah i hope that you watch this video well and i hope that this entertained you i know it has been months since i last updated here in my youtube i actually have tons of video drafts waiting to be uploaded but i haven't edited lots of it and i've been very busy with midterms i have midterms in two weeks but wish me luck and hope you'll have a great day today bye see you on my next video